Okay, guys, so in the last episode, you know that I put Naz Reed on the trade block. So, I started simulating up to the next game that we're going to be playing in this video. And the Knights, the Kansas City Knights, hit me up with this trade offer involving Bruce Brown for Naz Reed. Now, they wanted me to give away, I think, a first round pick. No way. I'm not giving up a first round pick for Bruce Brown. We're going to try to get a pick off of them. Uh, let's see what they think about an <laughs> unprotected first. And heck, we could even throw in like a... I don't know, a Thanasis? You need a Thanasis? Uh, we'll see what they think about the, this. will put the breed under the minimum player limit. The team can do this trade using a minimum player limit exception that lasts two weeks. Okay, we'll try this. Uh, not interested in this trade. However, I have a counter offer. They want a first round pick. Yeah, no, I'm not getting rid of that. So, remove. Let me just make sure I don't. Haywood Highsmith. Not interested. Um, let's see. What would you say about giving up a second round pick unprotected? What would you say about this? Not interested counter offer they want a second round pick from us for their s that wouldn't make sense swap worst and then we give away no i'm not doing that um i'm gonna leave theirs on there i'm not giving away any picks uh naz reed's gonna get um you know what Yeah, discard. Um, we are going to decline. They want to be stubborn, I can be stubborn as well. Here is what I've been waiting on, the scouting, man. Now, this is where the series really starts here in Season 1. So, we're going to change target players. We're going to go look at shooting guards. Um, Jack Wade here, he is six foot nine. I mean, obviously, he can play small forward. Boy, could probably make play power forward as well with his weight. Um, I mean, he's taller than Brandon Clark. He weighs more than Brandon Clark. This boy is a primary shooting guard. He's the number one overall player in the draft. Six foot nine. I mean, he's number one across the board. Strengths, great vision, solid playmaker, extremely aggressive around the rim, not afraid to challenge defenders. This guy should be attacking the rim constantly. He's an A-plus finisher. He has no significant weaknesses. He's averaging 40 a game! 7 assists and 4 rebounds, 2 steals, 1 block. He's shooting 56% from the field, 87% from 3. Okay, there's no way he's shot a lot of 3s, right? B plus inside scoring, A minus mid range, A plus three, B playmaking, A minus perimeter defender, um, athleticism, A plus basketball. Okay, this, I mean, clearly we're gonna do that. Um, so how many can we can scout 16 people? Okay, Andre Patton, 6'5, 223. He is. Covering around a top five, top three player in the draft. Um, a minus inside, A plus on both mid range and three point scoring. A plus perimeter defense. We're getting a defender. We're not going for someone that's bad at defense. A athleticism. Um, outstanding vertical. Should be able to provide rim protection. A force of the rim uses creative angles to finish. Plays above the rim, able to finish with authority. No significant weaknesses again. He's averaging 22 and 6 assists, <clears throat> shooting 29% from the field, 22% from 3, 60% from the free throw line. That's not exactly what I'm looking for. Um, we're going to give him a look, though. Um, Alright, done. We're not looking for anybody yet that's in the Cs. Let's go look at sh point. Go wow. Um, Dale Ryan, this is the number 2 possibly overall player in the draft six foot two 193 dale ryan that's an interesting name um 
Weaknesses can barely dunk, not a good finisher. Strengths, I think this guy can create his end shot at the next level. Solid finisher can be counted on to make shots at the rim. Knows how to distribute the ball to his teammates regularly. Okay, so he's not really a... He can create his end shot. Uh, he's averaging 26 points per game. 9 assists. I figured he'd be more of a assist type of point guard, which is fine. 53% from the field, 71% from three, 83% from the free throw line. He's only played one game. Um, I've not been looking at that. Uh, A minus inside scoring, A mid range, B minus three, B plus perimeter defense, good athleticism, B. His overall is a C plus. Uh, we'll give him a look, but I don't. I'm not too confident in that one. Um, Brooke Kennedy. Uh, five foot eleven. He's a bit short. Um, three point scoring, athleticism, and mid range scoring. Um, C perimeter defense. That's just gonna tell me right there that it's a no. Um, let's go ahead and look at small forwards now, because we could use a small forward, Moody. Uh, Bates D up and um, who am I? Who else am I? Isaiah Joe has been playing small forward a little bit. Uh, I got Christopher Finley here, six five six nine two fifty three. And he's probably gonna be a bit slow. Um, not a good defender. He's from LSU. Go Tigers. Um, yeah, perimeter defense D plus. Post defense C plus. Nope, not looking at that. Jr. Ford here from Vanderbilt, six foot eight, two o eight. Um, again, not much of a defender. Karen Payne. Wow. Oh, position rank number two. Okay, got you. Um, Payne, six foot eight, two o four from Rutgers. Not much of a defender. Alright, I mean, I'm just gonna move on to power forwards then. We got Nico Dabanovic. He's sitting at number 6, 5, 10, 1, 1. Okay, I mean, he's looking pretty solid from that. He's from Lithuania, so he's foreign. We do have scouts that are good at foreign scouting. Uh, mid-range scoring, perimeter defense, post-defense, B+, plus, rebounding, A-, minus, IQ, C+. Plus. Okay. No significant weaknesses. Good dunker, really solid overall finisher, is a good low-post scorer. Fundamentally sound low-post defender gets the job done. That's what I'm looking for right there. Um, really good finisher, power suit contact, capable defender in low-post, knows how to get it done. Boxes out well and knows how to pull down difficult rebounds. Okay. Dylan Baker. Good post defense. C plus rebounding. Um, a bit iffy. I like Dubonovich more. But we'll give him a look. Todor Baja. Okay. Seven foot at the power forward position. Uh, 249. I wish I could see their speed and all this. Uh, inside scoring, mid-range scoring is a A. Not, he's a okay three-point shooter. He can make them. A, post defense. B, rebounding. See, if you're going to be 7 foot 249, you got to have an A, rebounding. Good athleticism. Um, we'll give him a look, just, uh, just in case. Moving on to center, Alan Jeffries. Um... Let's give him a look. Seven foot two, two forty seven. Good inside scoring, good mid range scoring. Uh, a post defense, B rebounding. C. You gotta be a little bit higher than that. Um, I'm looking to go a little bit smaller because I want to be able to run. Like I want people who can get down the court on defense. Terrell Keller, seven foot one, two seventy four, Illinois from Illinois. Um, he can shoot the three, so we have a stretch five, possibly. 
B minus post defense. D athleticism. I'll put him on there just for the heck of it, but I don't know. Um, I mean, heck, that's really <laughs> that's really all I like from this class. Um, let's just look at the top ten here. We have nine prospects left. Uh, Lance Weber, he's a point guard. Did we look at him? I don't know if we did. Probably not. He's a C-. minus. We're looking at potential here. Uh, we don't really know. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't know that anybody else really catches my eye. Brooks Kennedy, we saw him. Um, Elliot Bates. Perimeter defense, what is he, a shooting guard? No, nah, we can't be having that. Okay, well, I mean, are you sure you want to scout these prospects? Yes, I do. Um, we're going to add a new goal. We're going to scout best first rounders. I hope... Yeah, that keeps all the guys that I wanted to scout. Yeah, okay, add new goal. We're going to do uh, scout around pick. We're going to target, like third pick um at a new goal we're gonna do scout best second rounders just do all that so uh we got all of our guys in there um i hope that's all the people that i wanted to scout because i hope they did not change when i set the um the goals here i hope they did not like undo everything uh the breeze have injury issues to manage moses moody Sore left hand day today is a new injury. Uh, we're just going to leave it as is. He's fine. Uh, he's healed. Alright. Yeah. Uh, Alright. So we're losing. We're losing. We're losing. We're winning. Alright. We got to win against the Pelican. Here we are. We're 8-19. and 19. We're taking on the Cincinnati Lions. They sit at... What's their record? 12-13. and 13. So, uh, yeah. We're not looking too good. They got Cameron Payne, Contavious Caldwell Pope, Harrison Barnes, Kelly Olynyk, Jalen Duran, Karis Levert, Trendon Watford, Go Tigers, Grant Williams, Najee Marshall, Miles McBride, Christian Coloco, Delano Banton, Bryce McGowan, Goins, Gowans, Patrick Baldwin Jr. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a look at the conference. The Heat are out in front at 22 and 7. Uh, no expansion teams are... Oh, there's the Lions, actually, right there in the playoff hunt. Um, and yeah, we are the third worst team in the in the Eastern Conference here. Um, the Bronx Brawlers. We are the worst expansion team in the Eastern Conference, record-wise. Um, let's look at the West. The St. Louis Sound have made a big jump up. I think it was the Knights who were doing pretty solid. Um, the Knights are down to 14 and 14. The Surf are 11 and 18. So we're the worst expansion team. Uh, that's not good. Um, in our division, we are battling with the Atlanta Magic for that coveted last place spot in the division. So, yay. Okay, here we go. We are at home for this one. And Naz Reed gets the jump ball. Still on the team, unfortunately, but we want to get the right we want to get the right pick for him, you know, the right deal. We're going to go down to him. He's got Jalen Duran on him. I would assume he could have some success with this. Oh my goodness, and Naz Reed starts off with the bang. All right, here we go. I We're going to not make any adjustments at the moment. We're going to see how the game plays out. If anybody starts hurting us, oh, there's a double screen. Get out there, Joe. Good job. Caldwell Pope dancing. Get that out of here. Blocked by Brandon Clark. Here we go, baby. Nemhard cutting through. Good finish by Andrew Nemhard. We're off to a hot start offensively. Let's go. Up 4 nothing. We're trying to get a win here. We've not gotten a win in a few episodes. And even in simulation, we're not doing too hot.
Payne going to cut. Good, good rotating defense right there. Oh, he puts up a three. Is Harrison Barnes. Is that Duran who got the rebound over Reed? Looked like it. He had inside positioning on him. I mean, Reed got absolutely cooked in the last episode by Clint Capella, so not to say this is a surprise. Come here, Clark. Brandon Clark, you ain't stopping him. You ain't stopping him. Is that Kelly Olenek? Nah. I gotta quit moving around so much on defense. Get across. Oh, he faked the screen there. Good job, Reed. Taking away. Step up. Step up. And. Yeah. I mean, I think Reed wanted to switch that right there. That's not what we were doing. I was just fine. Come here, Joe. We're gonna get you on a screen and fade here. I don't need that. Nemhard. I mean, I don't know. I don't know, actually, if Joe was open. And nobody stopped the ball, and that's gonna leave campaign wide open. I don't know who that was that stepped up. And, you know, didn't stop the ball and just left. I don't know who that was, and you're lucky I'm not going to look. So. <laughs> Nemhard just has to throw it up. That was an ugly play. I just, that's the first time I saw that play, and I was just, I didn't know what was even happening. Reed is wanting to take on campaign. What? Three second violation? That's gonna be our ball. All right, we got it. Campaign's been doing pretty well the last four games, averaging dang near 20 points. All right, come on. Let's run a play. I'm pulling that with Moody. I like the shot. I was not mad at it. It was probably a better shot than what we were going to get, so. And, yep, yeah, I did not know I switched on to the guy in the middle of the paint right there. I thought I switched on to the guy on the ball. See, it's stuff like that that just really frustrates me. Okay. Nemhard just has to put it up, dude. We have some ugly freaking possessions. I mean, just nothing is happening. Nothing is happening. And they're gonna throw a lob to Duran. Naz Reed got beat back door. That just can't happen, Naz. That cannot happen, Naz Reed. I swear, whenever I play these games, it gets so hot in here, in this room, man. It does not help the situation. Like, we need defenders. Especially down low. Brandon Clark does fine. Naz Reed gets absolutely destroyed. We have Tyson coming off a double screen. We're gonna give it to him. He's gonna shoot a three. He's gonna miss it. We have people. We need people who can make shots. We need people who did it. can play defense. I say that as campaign gets a wide open shot. For, not wide open, but up the, to Brandon Clark. Please finish the freaking shot, man. I mean, come on. Campaign in the corner for three. I got stuck on the defender. I mean. How are we so tired? Nemhard off a screen, no good. I know the meter is not good. <sighs> Luke, you freaking suck, man. Payne, Fader, and Duran gets the offensive rebound again, dude. I'm going to have an aneurysm if I see Duran get one more offensive rebound. That's the second or third one I've seen him get, and it's only the first freaking quarter. 
It wasn't even Naz Reed that time, it was Brandon Clark. Like, what are we doing, man? Isaiah Joe, off on the release, dude. I hate the shot meters, I really do. See what the CPU can do on on-ball defense, because... I mean, Terrence Mann did pretty solid. What are you doing? <laughs> Isaiah Joe can't hit a layup. Andrew Nemhard, 4 3, no good. Oh my god! That was ugly, dude. That was the ugliest first quarter I've ever seen. Like, I really don't think it's just me. Like, sure, I'm not hitting the freaking shot meter on a lot of these. And I'm probably, you know, desperate to make a shot. So I'm just putting some weird shots up. But I swear it's not just me, man. Like, this team just... Naz Reed's over here getting beat by Kelly O'Linick, man. Naz Reed's getting beat off the dribble by Kelly O'Linick. Like, are you kidding me? That's not what I wanted. I wanted to give it to Reed. That's why you always gotta do the icon passing, I suppose. And that's gonna be, wow, a miss. I was not expecting that result. Curry for three, no good. I think that was, that was probably the worst shot I've taken all game by far. My dude, that was a forced shot and a half. Okay. Okay, you should be able to take Olenek. My god, my dude sh just launched it up there like it's a cannon. Like his arm's a cannon or some shit. Why was that such a delayed jump? And that's gonna be Marshall wide open for three in the corner. No good, Tyson rebound. Okay, please let's score, man. Into Naz Reed. Oh my god, dude. Like, how, man? Olenek hardly even played a, played a part in that play. He went under the screen. Like, what? Why would you go under that screen, dude? Oh, what a play. Terrence Mann for three. No good, dude. Can I hit a shot? See, it's really... I can't help it, man. It just gets my blood boiling. When just... <laughs> Lavert off the screen. Wow. I mean, it's... Really ugly offense from both teams. Finally, we score, dude. Like, if we had an even, just an okay offensive night, we'd be up by, like, probably 8 points right now. 8 to 10 points. If we just had an okay offensive day. But no, we're over here having the worst offensive day in the history of the NBA. Okay, maybe not that much. No, it's probably up there. I don't know why I'm being nice about it, being generous. It's probably up there. We suck. Oh my god, greed. Nemhard with a steal. Tyson in the open field. and Open field, Luke. Yep, tells you where my head is right now. Alright, let's go, man. Let's go. Let's see if we can get a few more plays to go our way. 
That's good help. That's good uh, recovery there by Reed. Over to Tyson. Tyson puts it up and then we're down by five, man. Let's go. Want a, what, 6 0 run? Man, that's just some pretty good stuff right there. Defense chant is kicking in. Campaign off. They get an offensive rebound. It's out of bounds on us. We've got to stop giving up offensive rebounds. All right, I'm guarding their basket right here. Oh, God. Oh, God. All right, not too shabby. Get over there. Barnes is gonna have to take a shot. He's gonna get... Oh, it's stolen. That's off of him. Let's go. Good defense, boys. I don't know who that was. Moses Moody? No idea. All right. Let's go. We have under... Just about two minutes to go here in the first half. We... With how terrible we have played, we are still in this game. Isaiah Joe off the screen for three, baby. Let's go. We finally hit something. A 9-0 run right now for the Breeze. That's a timeout for the Lions. Let's go. I don't know if the crowd knows that we're on a timeout break right now, but they're chanting defense, but I'm all for it, man. Keep the energy going. And they stop, they stop when we actually go on defense, so, you know, that's fine, I guess. Oh, Barnes loses the ball. We have it! Go, Nemhard. What are you slowing down for, dude? Over to Tyson. Oh, can't get it to go. I forced it. Fudge. Lob to Duran. Wow. I mean, that just can't happen, Reed. <laughs> that just can't happen, Reed. Like, I don't know how many times I've been saying this to you the last couple games, man. That can't happen, Reed. He's going to have to get trademarked by me or something, because my goodness. I hate this play. It takes so long. Isaiah Joe for three at the top of the key. That was a good release, too. That's not my fault. What do I do? Oh, Caldwell Pope for three. I mean, I don't know what to freaking do, man. I have to stop the ball. I have to play the corner three. Obviously, you stop the ball first. And just, you let someone like Caldwell Pope shoot, I suppose. Isaiah Joe looking to answer. He does just that. In the corner as well. Let's go, man. If only we've had this offensive rhythm going from the start of the game, this would not, we would not be trailing right now. Yep, don't switch. Good job. Get the board. Go. Leak it out to Joe. That rhymed. Oh, Joe beats Barnes. Come on. Oh my god. Like, I wish I would get an animation where I'm, like, going to the hoop. Because obviously I have... Oh! Stolen by Nemhard! Ah, let's go, man! Much better energy here in the second. We have eight seconds. Do, do not get beat. That's a forced shot. There's no way. I was not playing on ball there. I'm sorry. I had to let the CPU do it. I, I would have lost my mind if I would have given up a score. We've played the worst half of our lives. We played the first worst first quarter of our lives there in the in the first quarter obviously and we're still only down by two. Alright, start of the second half here. <sighs> Let's go. Caldwell Pope kinda gets around right there. Off the sh Mark, though, Joe working on Kelly Olynyk gonna draw a foul, and he's a really good free throw. Let me shut up, I'm not jinxing anything. Knocks it down, looking to tie the game here, man. Alright, now I'll say it. Really good free throw shooter. <laughs> I was not about to do, like, a little announcer's jinx or whatever you want to call that. 
Do I believe in jinxes? Yes. Also, um... Oh, Jalen Duran with a wild reverse layup. Just acting as if Naz Reed is not even there. Because, honestly, he really isn't. Um... What are we doing? Oh, I like this play for Joe. Joe in the corner for three. Oh, my in and out for Isaiah Joe. Okay, okay, okay. I thought we were about to get beat right there. Wow. Post hook off the mark. Rebound Isaiah Joe. No. Hold on. Yep. Moody. Come take it. Reed. Come up. Set a pick. Fade to the three-point line. Got him. What in God's name are we doing? That's not what I wanted to do at all, dude. How is Naz Reed so tired, dude? Like, dude, you just came out of halftime. You should not be dead tired right now. I'm making it a priority to focus on using... Dude, Jalen mother effing Durin. What is going on? Get on him, Naz. That should not happen, dude. Brandon Clark for three. No good. In and out again. Like, what? <laughs> like, I'm not going to get a perfect release every single time. Then there's... Dog. Is our interior defense just non-existent completely? Like, what in the world is going on? And to Brandon Clark, there's no way Olenek is stopping him. Okay. Yeah, well, like I've been trying to say, I'm using Isaiah Joe a lot more because he is just very lazy on defense. The Lions take a timeout. Um, and yeah, I just, I can't handle Isaiah Joe's incompetence on defense. I just can't. So, I'm using that as an excuse to, um, not play on ball defense. I should be using Isaiah, or Naz Reed more. I don't know if Darren can shoot. That's a problem. I'm going to use Mort Reed a little bit here. Maybe I can make Naz read into an all an all NBA defender. Oh God, they went for a steal right there. We got him. No, we don't. All right, calm down. Come here. Over to Joe in the corner for three. No good. That was our best chance to make a shot, I think. Terrence Mann, the only defender back. Into Duran, fouled by Brandon Clark. I mean, at least we're going to let him make him earn it, I suppose. Alright. My boy almost fell on his face from a free throw. Oh, Isaiah Joe cuts inside. Draws a foul on the other end on Con... Con oh, my goodness, Luke. Caldwell Pope. Can't even say his name. Important free throws here, man. We're gonna have to get Joe a break. We're down by three. More than midway through the third quarter. Reed, I swear to God. Glad he didn't get beat that time. Pope is tired. He's going to have to put up a terrible shot. Terrence Mann rebound. Let's go. Alright, hold on. Oh, we got Joe wide open. Bang! It don't matter if Isaiah Joe's tired, man. Let's go. We just were patient with it. We didn't force a shot, and something opened up for us. Get across that screen before he gets to it. Reed, pick him up, please. Good job. Oh, God. Out to Olenek. He's tired, though. Please. Oh, my goodness, dog.
All right. Joe is out, so that's not good, but it's kind of good for later on in the game. We got to get Curry going, dude. Like, over to Brandon Clark. Go up. Oh! Can we get an and one, please? Just kidding. I don't know. Um, probably not. Terrence Mann's a pretty good defender. Oh, Brandon. All right, Linux tired, so I like this. I like this matchup. Oh my god, what? I did not do that. No! Clark! Oh, let's go! I don't know why it went across the court like that instead of two Brandon Clark down the middle. That's who I wanted to go to the first time, but we it worked out still. We're up by one point, man. Nearing the end of the third. Oh, God. Barnes, my goodness. Like, every time we get something going, dude, they hit a three, and it's so demoralizing. Moody off the screen. Come here, Reed. That's a reach in. Or a blocking foul, McBride, actually. Come here, Clark. Got it to Clark on the inside. Let's go. Tie game. Risky pass, but honestly, I would take that that risky pass and chance to turn over rather than put whatever else we had up. All right. 35-35 going into the fourth quarter, man. Oh, boy. It's going to be down to the wire. I hate fourth quarters because we always collapse in the fourth quarter. We've had two or three collapses in the fourth quarter this season so far. Nikhil Alexander-Walker in the game. Curry, man, Tyson, and Bassey alongside him. All right. This is an interesting lineup. Honestly... Come here, Bassey. Oh, Terrence, man! Let's go, man. <laughs> no pun intended, I guess. I don't know. Maybe it was. Probably was. All right, we're up by two. No, no. That's a foul. Don't make that. All right, we're sending Grant Williams to the line for two. Come on, make him miss one. He's not gonna miss one. He looks confident, man. Oh, I'm trying my heart out. Okay. I like Alexander Walker. I do. I think he should be getting more playing time. I like his size. I like his speed. Oh, God. I... All right, we're going to send him on a fade. I mean, Tyson walks out of bounds. Dude, we had something, and he just wants to step out. Of, like, go up strong with it, Tyson. Go up strong with it, dude. I tried to get a cheeky steal there. We'll we'll take a reach in foul. We'll take it. It's better than not trying. Grant for three. You've got to be kidding me, dude! I was right there, man. That was not okay. That was not that bad of a defensive closeout right there. Terrence Mann going to the rack. All right, off the pick and roll. We were able to slip free. Terrence Mann can hit the three, but honestly, I don't want to chance my meter timing, my shot meter timing right now. 
Levert gonna force something that's so terrible. That he got open, that is. Man, breaks free again! You've gotta be kidding me! What are you doing? I don't care if you're tired. Get your ass up! He just left him. Tyson just left the dude wide open with the ball in the paint. Levert off. Oh, I can't believe what just happened in the last possession, dude. Okay, we got Grant Williams. That's not going in. Oh my god, that's, dude, oh my fudge. I'm gonna piss myself off. It already happened, actually. Not going to, I'm, I already did. McBride scares me. He seems pretty quick. I'm here. How is it not a steal? Don't do that, Tyson. He has to force it. That's good defense. That came way too close. Oh my god, Tyson and... Oh. See, I got scared because I thought I had the icon pass up. Oh, Curry. Quick off the screen. Let's go, Curry! Up by 1, 244 to go. Seth Curry makes an appearance offensively. What a shot. Okay. I mean, we're playing the opposite of how I envisioned this team playing. I mean, I figured we'd be like a 3 and D type of team. No, we're, we're pounding the rock inside, man. That's how we're getting our points. It's not really sustainable. Campaign puts up a shot. No good rebound by our boy Isaiah Joe. I wanted to get that to Nemhard, but I don't want to force a risky pass. How is Joe tired? Come here, Reed. Down to Clark. Clark! Oh my, how in the fudge do we not get the... Oh, Moody, I saw that. I saw how you butchered that. You better beat him and make up for it. Let's go, Moody. You made up for it, dude. You almost got beat right there. You almost angled that terribly. Up by three. Under two to go. Campaign's going left. Yep. Had to guess on that one. We're all over him. Nemhard's all over him. Oh, we got... No! Durin offensive rebound. I'm glad he kicked that out because he has a crazy mismatch. With Nemhard, Payne takes a pull-up jumper. That was a good defensive possession, dude. I can't be mad at it, I guess. I am mad at it, actually. What are we doing? Nazreed is not... We get it into Clark. He misses the shot. Dude, Clark, I love you, dude. You're, you've been our probably our best player so far this season. You've got to make that. Caldwell Pope out to Payne for three in the corner. Oh my god, we got so lucky. That was my man. Okay, let's calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I'm getting scared. Clark. No way, dude. I had the meter full, man. That should count for something. We fouled. I'll take it. I will take it. I will take it. We got a timeout. Oh my god, there's 26 seconds left. They had the ball. <sighs> okay. I'm playing Darren with Reed right now. Dude, why did it kick me off? I was there, man. And there's no way with how he pulled that back that we don't get the block. Now we're down by one, 14 seconds. Give me Isaiah Joe.
they double. Dude, pass the ball! Are you kidding me? We have to win this, Joe. We do. Joe for three! Oh! Isaiah Joe, man! Five seconds. Get up there. Oh my! Let's go! Let's go! Isaiah Joe for the freaking win, man! Oh my goodness. Can we get back there that far? Please tell me. Oh my god. Isaiah freaking Joe. Seven seconds left. My boy is cold blooded. He wins the jump ball. I did not think we we're going to win it against Harrison Barnes. I don't know how we did. Because look at Barnes. <laughs> I don't know how we won it. But he does. I think the ref gave us a favorable, you know. No, he didn't. I mean, all right. Joe is just quicker. He wins the jump ball. Clark comes up with it. Goes behind the back. And then Barnes just loses him. And Isaiah Joe, bam. My boy. Let's go. My goodness, Isaiah Joe, man. What a game from him. He was sixth man. This is his first game back in the starting lineup in, a, in quite some time. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Brandon, congratulations. You guys may have faltered a bit coming out of the gates, but you finished strong. Yeah, man. I mean, that's just us, really. Uh, you know, we're just always trying to feed off the energy. Uh, so it did kind of take a while there at the start, but once once we uh, picked it up, it was all fun. The energy was there when it mattered the most. Strong finish. Thanks, Brandon. Yeah, I mean, that was perfectly said by her. Started off slow out the gate, but we picked it up. Isaiah Joe is our player of the game. My boy went off. Mm. The game winner, man. Oh my goodness. What a game it was, though, man. I mean, Joe with 16 points, 6 rebounds, 1 assist, 1 steal, 4 of 11 from the field. All four of his makes were threes. He had four free throws as well, which came up huge. Clark, 10 points, 4 rebounds. They both scared, carried the scoring load. You got Nemhard, man, and Tyson all with four. Um, I mean... For the Lions, Jalen Duren was an absolute behemoth. Everybody that plays Naz Reed, plays against Naz Reed, does good. So it's really whoever offense on Naz Reed. So, <sighs> campaign 3 of 12. Took the most shots by a large margin. Um, yeah, I mean, really, Naz Reed is really the only deficiency in this game defensively. Team comparison, we shot 42%, they shot 37%, uh, 31% from three, 33% from them, uh, I mean, just not a very good offensive night for either team. We had 30 points in the paint, 13 assists, we had 23 rebounds to their 33, they out-rebounded us by 10. Uh, we forced 6 turnovers. And, um, yeah, I mean, dude, wow, my heart is still racing. Isaiah Joe with pretty much a, not really a buzzer beater win, but I'm going to call it that, um, <laughs> just to make it sound cooler. Uh, but, yeah, I mean, we're now 9-19. and We're probably not going to make the playoffs by any stretch of the imagination. Um... But hey, if as long as, should we even be winning games because we're trying to get like a top five pick or something? Who knows? But yeah, I mean, what a game! But thank you guys for watching. <laughs> we finally got a win, man. I know we won our first two games of the season when we played them. Yeah, well, no, we lost to the Warriors. We beat the Surf. Yeah, this is only our second win. From actually playing the game, so. 
yeah, I mean, we'll take it, man. Gotta win over the fellow expansion team. And I uh, hope you guys did enjoy. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. What a game, man. Peace.